this is an inspiring video that will motivate and to give anyone an idea of how to take your dream and your goal to the next level in today's video i'm going to interview the first black man to have a taxi company right here in the city of hamelina Philan. stay tuned this is the man hello mr man how are you I'm fine, man. yeah this is the main man he is the first black taxi company owner in this city of Amelina, Philan. My brother, how did this thing come about? And introduce yourself to us. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> this is a long story, man. A long story. Man. Yeah. It's life of hustling. Uh, people think that uh, Europe is so, so easy, you know. Mm. But uh, Europe is not easy. When I came here, mm. it was... Uh, was so life is easy after when i get the permit in this country i study for here yeah, for about three three years one year and six months mm. for language school mm. then from there i got my uh, my <coughs> my qualification mm -hmm. admission mm -hmm. for my welding and fabrication mm -hmm. in the company i work with a work as a construction company and a workshop and everywhere around the field land for project. Yes. So along the line when they make a new law for taxi, everybody can own a taxi company, but I try to get mm. my taxi company. Mm. Then uh, I fight for exam for my taxi license and then I can get the taxi as company. a entrepreneur certificate and everything and running this uh, company wow so finland is, is is very 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 nice country you know this is my it's my taxi uh, you know uh, this is my private uh, car car going out uh, for the week you have another Friday. another one yeah, uh, yeah, yeah i have, have another uh, audi i would you have a two six two i would a six 2018 Model. model yeah yes so and how many people working for you now yeah i have a part-time workers like three three workers yeah sometimes once uh, twice in a week so, and they came over for yeah yeah two days shift two, two days shift. yeah yeah so it's interesting because it came from nowhere uh, he said when he arrived he has nothing no document nothing to write him about uh -huh. but after struggling, finally he got his uh, permit of stay right here in Finland, and he found out that oh, it is possible for him to have a taxi company. And but you know, the intriguing thing about it is that you know most of us when we come from Africa or other parts of the world, uh, we don't have diplomas, we don't have any special uh, experience. We block ourselves. We are scared to like do things, maybe work on our dreams. He had the dream of having his own company and he want to create, he want to like do something with his life. And with all the challenges, he doesn't speak Finnish and Finnish is one of the most difficult language in the world. Yeah, yeah. So he, he came and back home, he doesn't even have diploma. Back now, I have a diploma. I'm a welder, professional welder. You okay, know. he's a so professional welder. welder yeah. Okay. I see focus on my, my profession as a welder, you know. So I use that one mm. to get into this company. Yes. Because without the welding work, and I would, if I couldn't have a contract, mm. I cannot, you know, I cannot own a taxi company because I have to get a. Uh, something with uh, to get some money from the bank to to opening this company you know yeah huh. uh, very uh, very interesting pass through the banks and uh, through the project so you have something to show that you have a good contract and you have a good qualification you know, right yeah that means as soon as you have your permit your your document then you work with your profession your welding profession before yeah. you save money to start the uh, taxi company how do you do it 
Oh, this is like uh, when you have the first in Finland, when you, you have the permit, yes. you have to study the language. Okay. Yeah, you have to study the language because the language is the key because you cannot use English mm. to study welding here. And if you use the English to study welding, you probably you will not get a, you will not find a job. Yeah, okay. Because uh, after the language, then you have to apply because when we when we came from Africa, they believe that we don't uh, really know the job, mm. so they don't trust your certificate in Africa. Mm. So through that one, mm. so you have to go as as a as a qualification to get your qualification under six months or one year. Mm. Or if you don't get your uh, degree, mm. or degree can take you as then uh, it's two years. Uh, and six months mm. if you want to get your degree mm. and so after my qualification that's that where i find my job through my teacher you know okay so i got i got the first interview and i and they called me and i passed the the, the interview and the practical interview and okay. and they sent me for for project Okay. And when they see my first job, they say this guy is very good. Mm. Then they, since then they have been using me for work mm. as uh, welding for a lot of construction companies and uh, workshops. Okay. So after then, <coughs> I I opened this company. Then then people I was people was working with with my company. Yes. Then I was not driving. I'm just doing my welding work. Okay, so you just yeah, employ yeah, people yeah, to employ work. Employ people, yeah. Due, due, due to coronavirus. Yes. So and a lot of people they are, they don't want to work work in uh, driving taxi no more. I say, hey, fuck up. I have to come back mm. to get all the taxi line drivers license and entrepreneurship uh, certificate. Yes. To run the company as uh, owner. Yeah, by yourself. By myself, and because so, if I'm working as a welder. Mm. The salary was not enough to pay all my bills in uh, yes. the, the loans. And also, you, you have to pay your workers that workers, is working for you. Yeah. So because of so because of the coronavirus issue, most of his workers were scared to work. So uh, because normally in the beginning he just have his uh, company set up and he employ people to work for him. Why is still? doing his normal original job as a welder, welder yeah. but during the coronavirus outbreak people a lot of people are scared because of it so many stopped working many of his workers decided to stop so for him to be able to meet up with his uh, obligations the loans he collected from the bank uh, to be able to open the business and all that so he decided to stop his work now, his welding work, and take over the company, go and pass the license of uh, as a taxi driver, not only as a boss, because it's two different diplomas. Yeah, you, yeah, it, it's, it's two different. You have to have the... Before, when you got the, the taxi company, you get your business name, yes. you can open the taxi company. Yes. But you cannot drive with your, your normal driver's license. Okay. So you got to go for taxi driver's license. Yes. This is... Uh, the taxi driver's license uh, when you gonna get it yes is the taxi driver license yes so when you got this one yes then uh, after two years and they bring new law that we have to go for for test for okay. exam for entrepreneurship yes to get your entrepreneurship license wow so i've got that one mm. so everything about my company is legit yes it's legit. These are the POFs and the meters and the price and everything. everything. Uh, my business name is there. Yeah. My email and my details. Uh, this yeah. is uh, the your pin. Business, my, yeah, yeah. The business name numbers and uh, and the company with all and the code. Yeah. Yeah. The company yeah. numbers and uh, code, yeah. social system and all that. So, so, so it's not uh, it's not really it's not really easy. It's not really easy, but uh, I just tell everybody that uh, if one place is not good for you, you you gotta change your city. But nothing is easy for life, you know. Mm -hmm. It's not easy. Yeah, if people thinking that maybe when I'm in Finland driving taxi and own a taxi company, mm. they think like uh, this guy just came from nowhere. He having this opportunity. It's not one day job, mm -hmm. but it's all about life that uh, focus. Focus. Don't lose hope. 
perseverance. <laughs> you have to persevere. You have, you have to, to be focus. determined. You have to be strong. You know. Uh -huh. uh, no matter the difficult things you you go through, you you going to be be strong. very strong in life. And uh, obviously, one day you will conquer them all. So yeah, one you will, day, yeah, you will one succeed. Day. But all those things when I'm saying about it, it's about the seven uh, seven years ago now, I'm not thinking about them again. You see, because it's like it's over. It's over, yeah. yeah it's over. It's just the time to just make a cash and enjoy yourself. You know? <laughs> <laughs> so today, like, what kind of advice you have for someone now? Uh, for example, I am interested to have my own taxi company and also have my license. What are the procedures now with the acceleration changes of many things in in our world, in the society, maybe also here in Finland? How can someone be able to have his taxi license right now? And uh, how can we open the business, your business, how to do it now? Now? Now. If someone wants to open a business. A taxi company. A taxi company. Yeah. And also have the taxi license. How can we do yeah, it? Yeah, but if you want to get a taxi license. Yes. A taxi company in this yeah. country. Yes. Because uh, there is two exam. Yes. You have to uh, first. You have to have a taxi license, driver's license. Okay. Yeah. You have to have the taxi driver's license. Okay. Then you and to get in the taxi driver license, you have to the exam and the test is Finnish and uh, Swedish. Finnish and Swedish. Swedish. Okay. It's not English. Okay. So you have to use one of these to 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 pass your test. Okay. After your test, then you you use your license and to apply for the business okay. entrepreneurship uh, certificate. Okay. And that one you will see you have exam about 50 questions. Okay. And you have to get nothing less than 35. Good re response. Yeah, so to be able so, to get the license. To be, be able to get the license then before you can operate on a, a taxi company. Wow. But uh, it's not easy as it is yes. as before. Okay. Yeah, now now yeah. it's more difficult. It's now it's more difficult. And the question is more more difficult. They have changed it. Mm. So and uh, without a uh, Finnish language uh, you, you you cannot uh, operate but you must at least know the basic yeah, the basic the things Finnish, of the uh, language. Finnish language to run up. Trying to stop the taxi, you know. I'm mm. not at work. I'm just going to drop my brother. In. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Someone just stopped him now, but now because he's like. Is making the video with me and he's dropping me uh, in the train station because I'm going to Helsinki this afternoon to be able to explore Helsinki with you and to meet up though. so with someone over there so I have some things to do in Helsinki so I'm very sorry that he cannot be able to pick up a client so this is how it is I've said it all and for how long when you started passing the exam when you started passing the license uh, how long it takes how many weeks, how many days, how many months, or is it hours? The exam? Yes, to be able to get the license. No, that, that is uh, under 45, uh, one hour, the two hours uh, exam. Uh, okay, like but before you, go, before you go for the exam, you have to like uh, study... Yeah, for... you have to study the... the, 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 the questions or the... what they call it? You have, you Theor have to, the theoretical yeah, part. Part, yeah. You have to study, you know. So, so after then you can go there and uh, uh, write the exam. Okay. Uh, at the same time, I was in the class for some two days in the, the two weeks in, in taxi driving uh, school. License, uh, yeah, yeah. It's course for two weeks, and then you you prepare yourself to go and write the exam when you that you can make it okay like okay right first of all when you apply for it you have to there is you have to go to a, a taxi license school uh, you have to be in that school for yeah. about two weeks yeah two weeks then yeah. after they will give you all the books and all the information yeah, the questions yeah, yeah, what yeah, you need yeah, to read yeah, to prepare yourself to go and pass the yeah, exam yeah everything is in finnish and in swedish yeah in swedish okay in swedish one of the 
easy thing for what you understand. Yes. So the same thing uh, with uh, the entrepreneurship uh, certificate. The same thing. Then same after, thing. when you are ready, after the two weeks, you can go and study by yourself at home. Then when you are ready, you can apply for the exam. Yeah, you can, you can just apply online. Huh? Online, okay. Yeah. Oh, so thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you, brother. Thank you, brother. And yeah. we, you know, we, we, we have seen for more than 10 years. More you know? than 10, 10 years. years. Yeah. It is more than 10, 10 years. years, yeah. We, we meet, you know. It is so, not but, easy. Uh, coming to Freeland and... Uh, uh, be with with me. I'm so happy. I'm so uh, happy for your it is, effort. You know, uh, the pleasure. And everything. And it is my pleasure yeah. also because it's not easy. Thank it's not easy. Much, yeah. It is not easy. It's not easy. After ten years, the most important thing for me is that my joy is you are doing very well. I met you because we know when we are really like struggling in the early days. Yeah, early, early time. And yeah. so you come yeah. into a country, you have nothing today, now you are a boss, you are paying people, you are helping the society. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. it is that a is, blessing. You are a is, blessing to the society that, now. That is the thing that people don't know. Even when we are looking for a work, for we to get a permanent job, mm. it's very difficult. But uh, there is thing that people doesn't know that uh, it's life that uh, it's God mm. sues everyone for his, his own purpose. Purpose. Yes. There are people what God have created that when God destiny that these people will have to be mm. owner of a company. Oh. They will not be a workers. Yes. So that is me. But since when I'm working, even the project them is a contract work work stuff. But since when I'm operating this company, I've not three years now. Three years. Three years now I'm driving taxi now. When I when I leave, left uh, the welding job. So like, uh, so uh, how now long? I'm, I didn't stop for all these three years. I'm just driving, driving operating this company. Yeah. So at the same time, people are using my salary to to be surviving, feeding, paying their bills. So I'm so happy. Like but, the, the the average salary you pay is how much for the taxi driver? That someone drive regularly for you for a month, a month salary. Yeah, uh, a month salary. If you drive regularly after tax, you can get it two thousand euros. Two thousand euros. Yes, so you pay tax, you yeah. pay three people three uh, about six thousand euro every month. If no, if you if, drive regularly. If they drive regularly. Yes. If they drive regularly plus tax. Yes. We are talking about uh, ten thousand euros for three people. For three people. If they regularly driving. Wow. So this is uh, we are right now in the train station. So. This is how it is, man. So, I've yeah, been able. Capture, capture my, my, my colleague here, you know. Okay, these are taxi. Yeah, I'm yeah, coming to the taxi family stop side. Now. Yeah. Taxi stop now. I'm coming here to. With my car here. And... Yeah, this is his colleagues here. So, all these are taxi. So, if anyone is coming to Finland, you can give me a contact. This is my. My, 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 my business card. Uh, yes. Uh, so this is his number and everything. Yeah, my number. My I will have this one. So whenever you are in Finland, please contact him contact at your him. service. Yeah, anywhere. Austin anywhere Pofa. You are going, yes. Just, uh, just give me a call. 044 slash 9704568. Uh, and uh, email Austin Kofa at yahoo.com. Everything is here. I will put the, his details and his uh, contact also on the description of this video and also on the screen. So patronize him. Great guy, great guy, and have fun. And he can also give you great tips where to even hang out around Finland. Where to maybe if you want to go yeah, and hang course, out. He's a taxi driver. He's a taxi driver. Uh, he gets uh, all the package for company, you. Yeah, so Everywhere. If it's, we, we are the people where they are anywhere in tourists. If you are coming in the Finland, we mm. tell you destination where you go and get your fund. You know? <laughs> Anything you want is there to help you. If he's a man or he's a woman or a lady or a girl, you know. You any, any, fun. any. If you want yeah, to have fun, yeah. it's ready to guide you guide, and guide you and uh, tell you how to move. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So don't don't hesitate to contact mm, him. Yeah. So it is a pleasure, brother. I yeah, really appreciate. I really, really appreciate.
Thank you, Thank you very you. much. Yeah. So as soon as you came out from the train station, is here. You just contact him. Maybe he's at home, or maybe he went to drop someone. You know how it goes. So he will come back and pick you up. I am Joel Tamara. If you like my videos, please hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification so you will get notified of my upcoming videos. As I take you to every country on head. Until then, have a wonderful and inspiring day. Bye bye.